Hey guys, and welcome to a brand new YouTube training. In today's video, we're going to look at setting up a Facebook Messenger campaign. Now, Facebook Messenger campaigns are really great for people who don't want to send people to an application form or landing page to collect their details. And it's perfect if you want to set up a many chat flow as you would put the keyword in the messenger situation or the call to action and then a many chat flow would follow on. But for this training or for this video, we're going to look at just setting up a real basic messenger campaign where people click that call to action and then you follow up with them through messengers. So logged in to your ads manager, we're going to click create on the left hand side. Then up here, we're going to give it a campaign name. So for myself, I always tend to put the gender in first, then I put the type of campaign in. Then I will give it maybe a, an indication of what it is. So let's say this was a six week program and then I'm going to put the date. So today's date is the 28th of October. The reason I'm doing it this way is I know who I'm targeting, the type of campaign it is, the type of offer it is, and then we've got the date that we set or we launched this campaign. Then when we go back and look at past ads to see which one performed the best or to see compare different ones, we know and we'll by looking at the different dates which one is working where. We scroll down then to where it says campaign objectives, we click the traffic and we change this to messengers. Once that's done, all we do is scroll down to the bottom and press save. This should load up now on this screen. So this is what we call the campaign screen because we've got the campaign name, messages, and we've got the date or the title of that campaign. From here, then we're going to press the back button top left. And with this selected, so if it's not selected, give it a click. We can go to the ad set. If you don't want to go that way, all you do is just click the text. Now we're going to choose the audience or the people that we're going to target with the ad. So again, with this selected, we're going to hover over to the right hand side where the pencil button is. We're going to give that a click and we're going to start filling it in. So the ad set, we're going to call this copy one because we might run a different variation of copies. We scroll down to where it says the daily budget. We're going to leave this at five pound. We're going to scroll down a bit further to where we've got locations. We're going to take United Kingdom out and we're just going to drop the pin exactly where my gym is in Cardiff. So we click drop pin. We drop it exactly where the gym is and then it zooms out. Now you need to know your location really well to make this part work next. For me, I know the distance or 16 kilometers from the gym could take up to 40 minutes for people to travel here. And I know that's going to be too far. So in this box here, we're going to change that from 16 kilometers down to about eight kilometers. Now I know anybody coming within this circle should take less than 20 minutes to arrive at the gym. We're going to scroll down a bit further and we're going to target now the age and the gender. So this advert at the start member, we're targeting ladies. So we're going to click women and it's going to be an over 30s advert because we only work with over 30s here at the gym. So minimum age is 30 and we'll go for the maximum age as 50. And this is giving me a decent size audience. So we're targeting 78,000 ladies in a eight kilometer radius of Cardiff between the ages of 30 and 50. Scroll down a little bit further, then we come to the placement. This is where the ads are going to be shown to your target audience. So we're going to click edit placement. We're going to scroll down a bit further and click all devices, tick desktop off. We can click messengers off and we're going to turn so just remove and we're going to turn Instagram off too. All we want to do is show this to the news feed. So anything upset for news feed needs to be ticked off. So we'll tick all these off as well. And we're going to leave that like this. So now we've got 70,000 people in that audience. OK, so we're targeting people who are going to be on the Facebook news feed between the ages of 30 and 50 women in a eight kilometer radius of where the gym is. Finally, we then go to the ads. So we can either click this box here or if we go back, we just click ads here. 
with this text, we're going to click the pencil. We're going to select our page. So if your page is not already selected, you'll just find your page. We scroll down a little bit further and then we start filling this in. So let's go for an image first. So it's a ladies campaigns. We want to find a nice picture of some ladies smiling. Perfect. Let's go for this picture right here. Then we've got the ad copy that we're going to put in next. So if I just go and grab an ad copy really quickly now. Uh, let's just go for this one, a real simple one. So live in, let's just change this to Cardiff. Live in Cardiff, I'm looking to work with seven more local ladies that are completely looking to change the way I look and feel in just six weeks. Cardiff's number one body transformation for busy ladies, age of 30, got to the point. Perfect, perfect, perfect. We'll check out the video, we'll get rid of that. Interested, cool. Click learn more. And then put my name at the end and we'll get rid of this final bit here. Nice. So we've just put the picture in. We've just put the text in or the copy. So as you can see on the right hand side here, we've got the copy and we've got the picture. We're going to scroll down to where it said headline. In the headline, we're going to say wanted busy ladies in Cardiff. Perfect. So it's literally calling out to the people. So remember, in the ad set, we're targeting ladies over the age of 30. And this ad is talking directly to those people. We could even work on it a bit further. Live in, uh, so we could put wanted and busy over 30s ladies in around so it stands out even more so it's really calling out to that target audience really really talking to them we scroll down message we're going to call to action we're going to change that the message button is going to say learn more so again at the bottom now we've got the the little title we've got the button finally we're going to scroll down to where it says messenger start conversation and we're going to press edit the first thing we're going to do is turn all these off. So we're going to press X, X, and we'll turn this one to none. And then the message is going to be, hi, first name. Please let us know how we can help. So we're going to put, to get started. So, hi, first name. To get started, simply tell us a little more uh, about yourself. Then we're going to press save and finish. So now this ad is set up and ready to go. So all we do is scroll back up to the top. So it looks OK. We can press back here and we're going to press review and publish. Press publish. It's now going to take its time. It's going to be sent away. Facebook are going to do its checks, do its reviews, make sure they're happy with how everything looks. And then we go back to the ad, press the pencil. We're going to have a quick look. How it's going to look in Messenger. And this is what will happen. So when somebody clicks that learn more, it's going to say, hi, first name to get started. Simply tell us a little more about yourself. They're then going to message you with all that information you need. So this is a real simple Facebook Messenger campaign that you can set up in Facebook ads. It's perfect for those that have a keyword for many chats or they would rather speak to leads via Messenger on 
Facebook. If you like this training, simply comment below or give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to the page and any future trainings that you would like, simply comment below and let us know what you'd like to see. Cheers.